What's up, guys? It's Codex, not the winner. What's up, everyone? And we are back in Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. Yeah, I went back to the fountain to grab some more water, and I also saw that there's a path on the left there that we can take. But when I went back to this fountain, a digger buddy led came back. You know the guys who yeah. dig the ground? Yeah, yeah. So uh, I'm getting some info from him now. Okay. I'm gonna spill some info first. Fire block in the path. Don't you just pour water? I mean, how much? Oh, well, I get it. Okay, okay. The little water we got here is fed off some, by some far off water source called Lake Florida. Oh, we well, know where that is. Uh -huh. His buddy went hunting for a treasure in Baron Woods, and he told me he used the waterways there to find his way back home. Lake Floria was just about the biggest lake you can imagine, but if you check it out, there'd be enough water to solve your dilemma. Lake Floria, eh? Follow the Magma's advice if I return to Lake Floria. Visit the Water Dragon. And then use the Water Basin that injured the Water Dragon before. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Good enough for me, man. So yeah, I would definitely come over here and talk with our good friend. <laughs> Just so you know, I did what you said about the jumping around using the thing, yeah. and I found a What'd goddess cube. Ah. Up there. Yeah, sure. I'll snag it real quick. Lad. Because there's a save point over by there where we can fly up to the sky, yep. right? Okay. Lake Gloria. Since when it was kind of the talk and all this, the water basin. Thanks, Sled. And we're gonna run all the way up through here. There we go. Okay. I thought there was a save right here. Apparently, it's down here. Oh, bad timing. Did you dig at the hole that's out here? It looks miscolored. I did. I got anything special? Rupees from it. Huh. So I mean, like you might want it because you always I, I need rupees. Just, I, I, I think it's just the sunlight. Okay. It just looks like golden. All right, let's see if I can fly up to the sky from the save point here. Yep. Well, that worked out nicely. <laughs> yeah. I was just like, huh. So we gotta head over to the woods. Yep. And if I remember, the, the water dragon had her own, like. I believe so. But the fact that we need to uh, douse for the. Uh, Means that for whatever she misplaced reason, it. Keep it. Yeah. 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 I lost my own vessel. Uh, okay. None of the temple. So there's Floria Waterfall and Lake Floria. It's the waterfall one that we need to pick, I believe. Yeah, I picked the wrong one. <laughs> Again? <laughs> yeah, I picked the lake. Okay. So her chamber is... Back across this. No, 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 no. Straight back. <laughs> I'm uh, where that guy used his head as a key. Okay, okay. That was great. Are you, though? Apparently. Yeah, her sister's right here. I need this, please. 
Hey, I recommend you attempt to borrow this from the water. Oh, oh. Oh, yeah. oh yeah, that trans I was wondering oh. when we were gonna use that robot again, we haven't done anything for us. <laughs> Call him. I totally forgot about that. Yeah. I, I've been frustrated because it's like he's supposed to be able to go get things for us. I should be sending him out all the time to get us items. Like, what's right? going on? Like, his name's Scrapper and he's like doing quest lines. Wait, why wait us in the skies above? No, no, just go into the lake and get the. Uh, the lake's right there, bud. <laughs> we need the water first. Return to the sky, set our course for the volcano. So we're just going to pretend it's full of water. Is that what we're doing? I think so. All right. Okay. I'm okay with it. I just need to know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's right. I didn't have the normal swim on. Okay. Well, I'm going to say thank you to the dragon, first of all. Thank you, dragon. Um, I'm trying to get what I wanted from the dragon, so I did. <laughs> <laughs> I still want to read uh, Well, you know, she was like, have at it, man. I don't want that. So. She, well, she said she didn't want to soak in anytime soon, but, you know. Who knows if all of a sudden she wants to have a soak. I bet be gone with it. <laughs> Alright. So now we're flying back to the volcano. Yeah. Along the way, I'm gonna fly under the sky waterfalls. Yeah, because you gotta fill that up, right? Oh, it has water inside it. Does it? Can I can see, see it? it. Yeah, I can kind of see it. I can't, so I just ran it under a sky waterfall and I'm gonna count that as good enough. I can't see it at all. I'm gonna see if he takes it to um, the. Uh, go. Yeah, he kind of hit the wall, but he caught up to me. Okay, he does have water in it. This is the entrance to the volcano. I better get there for Master Short Pants. <laughs> My pants aren't that short. Whoa. Yeah, what? I did not choose here, first of all. Yeah, I know. Um, first of all, not cool. Why? Like, why? What? No. This is totally unnecessary and unrealistic. Why are we playing? Right. Why are we protecting Natalia? I hate Natalia missions. Oh no! It's one of the reasons why I love. Natalia. Well, I just say there's tons of Natalia. Okay. Oh, I went left. Yeah, I'm going left as well. I just killed all three of the guys. Anyways. The lower one, though, it's not yeah. even like the better one that we were at. No, it was the, it's the same one where we were. At. Oh right, no, no, we did. No, you're right, because we just blew the thing open. Yeah. yeah. Well, having the bow and arrow does make this a little bit easier. Oh, 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 it's an arrow. Oh, I thought it was monster stuff. Um. Okay. 
Okay. Yo, what? Yo, did you go in that hole? What hole? To the left before you went across the bridge. To see Tubert? Ooh. Do you like money? Do you want some rupees? Oh, is that mini game thing? It's a mini game? Oh. I believe so. Interesting. All right. <laughs> yeah, then. Never mind. I've just been using my bow and arrow to kind of kill, like, anything, even the big guys. I just took three hits. Oh, really? That's good to know, then. But my bow is one higher upgrade. Than yours. I'm not trying to be that guy. Okay. <laughs> Four. I did shoot him in the head each time. I don't know if that makes a difference. So it takes five hits to bring him down to grade your three. So an extra two hits, which is not too bad. Yeah. I was just doing it for comparative numbers because, like I said, there was only one, one upgrade. Oh, sure. Good to know. Yeah. It's a big damage boost. Okay, make my way up top. Where the hell? Taking this to the t like, where are we taking this again? I, I think like the tippy top. So we gotta go, go right. There with the hook thing on the left. <laughs> I got three arrows left. in the nipple. So we're definitely gonna need some more arrows. That should be it for him. Oh, got it. So I think the guy got shot down by a uh, fire. Uh, when I was like trying to fight the big guy in the bridge. It's gonna make me start over. Yeah. So, uh, I think everything I already killed is still dead though. So that's actually big. Ooh. Yeah, that big guy almost got almost killed by the little guy too. He's like, help, help. He's like smoking right now and all this stuff. Like, oh. Yeah, the one, there's one more little guy who was hiding, don't get me wrong, because I killed the, all the other little guys before that, but hey. Oh no! Okay, mine just died while I was in the middle of the yes. Don't worry, everything's still dead. I only ran into one slime so far while traversing that through.
Now. I did get a checkpoint. Did you? Nope. I have to go back to the start, but everything's already dead. Mm. Mine was uh, right after that village. Fantastic. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you went, they went right to the bottom of you then. Yeah, it's a long run back up, I'll tell you that. At least you're just running like everything's dead. Yeah. I don't want to wait for you. Hurry it up, dude. He's, he's actually complaining about waiting for him. That's hilarious. I just turned around as he reminded us he's like right behind me. Now, uh, I did leave that guy alive up there to the left guy, or right guy. So yeah, yeah, that fire arrow guy. So what I'm going to do is actually double back around and kill him. And if I'm lucky, I get some arrows. Is that everything dead here? Four arrows, I, you know what? I will. I guess Codex is saying there's a checkpoint right after this. Check. Oh my god, I went all the way down there for. Yeah, you just said, Burr, wait for me. Um, buddy, I was going down there for arrows. There was no arrows, so you could just stay up there. Just, just throw that one up there. Kind of, like right before you get up to that big, big, tall hill. I got the checkpoint. How am I supposed to handle those if he doesn't get out the way? Got all the bats. Oh my god. They all surrounded him the second we entered the room and they like they're too tall to target. You can't shoot down that many bats in three seconds. I gotta draw their aggro first. So that's poor design. Yeah, I don't have like any this is okay. kind of irritating. What is that's that save? Down. Maybe if I'm lucky, I can get here before he does. No. Because I have no more arrows, so it's like... You better find some arrows. Basically, all the big spots have been giving me back arrows. This one's Everything else gives me heart. And he just died. Bro. I just made it across the fire lake. I'm entering the dark room now, so there shouldn't be any enemies along the way here now. Unless yeah, I'm at temple entrance is where it keeps bringing me back. Nice. Yes and no. I mean, to get through that, all you have to do is, uh, whatchamacallit? No, it's past there. I don't know if, if you're at where I'm stuck. Where are you stuck? There's a guy on on top of the... Uh, there's two archers, one on top, and there's also a big guy on the bridge. Yeah. I'm just stuck there. Okay. Uh, I mean, without arrows, that's going to be a very tough part to pass. Thank you. So go all the way back down and get some arrows from the first big spot. <laughs> oh, so good news is if you run too far ahead of him, he actually can't catch up. Okay. Which is good. So then he just stops there until you go talk to him. Again. Like, hey, I'm ready to catch you. So you can kill everything. Uh, yeah. So that's where I first died on that bridge, and it sent me all the way back to the start. Yeah, so that's where I died on the bridge, it sent me not to the start. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah. So I didn't get whatever checkpoint that Codex got. Uh, but yeah, I died there, and then the second time, I uh, since I went back to the start, I got full arrows again, and then shot everyone down with arrows. Um, if you don't fully charge the arrows and get headshots every time, it takes me like five to six arrows instead of three. Uh, 
And once I passed there, there's only one more challenge other than that. It was basically in the fire thing. You had to take on like a couple lizard boys while you have like the uh, little frog guys in the lava. So shoot down the frog guys in the lava with your bow, and then you can shoot the lizard guys with the bow as well, but you can also just get up. Okay, come on. I killed yeah, the I big guy. I we were already into the fireplace, because that's my first checkpoint when I walked into the fire. I was like, no. okay, cool. The codex must be, like, almost done. <laughs> no, I'm still here. How wrong I was. Yeah. <laughs> uh... Okay, he's, he's still like, buddy, why don't you come find me on your map? And I'm like, no, man, I'm... Clearing the area for you so you don't die. Yeah. Yeah, and I'm doing it the hard way, like where you without the arrows. <laughs> you got a slingshot, don't you? Yeah, I I need more ammo for like everything. Uh, gotcha. The fire sanctuary. Don't leave me hanging like that. So I believe this is the actual. Yep, this is the actual dungeon. Cool. So this one had way less of a story to get to the dungeon, whereas I feel like the desert one took quite a bit longer, like you have to explore with that uh, ship and all that before you reach the dungeon. Go. Oh. Now he's just standing there, like, help me, help me. This is such a trap. Fine, like, you literally have to go two feet. The guy's not even shooting at you, dude. I'm trying to, like... Crap, it's disappearing. Ah, that doesn't stay up long. Right Good to know. Um, yeah, dude, I don't know which. You uh, don't know what? You do something for a change. Words. No, I'm just. Uh, so, my guy won't move because there's a monster above him. Like, it's the one above the door. And I can't kill him because I don't have an arrow or anything. <laughs> I told you to go back and get yourself the arrows. I did. I just haven't got done the, the walk yet. Because there was a way to kill all the other guys. But just that one there was. No, no I hear you. But <laughs> make life easier because you're going to need arrows. Oh, no way. Uh, so there's a dig spot inside the dungeon that has a berry. Nice. <clears throat> Just gonna prepare you for that, so when you find your first dig spot in the dungeon, you're like, oh, let me get my bottle out, and then you see target the fairy, and then you press A. Just scoop them right on in. So there is some bombs. Which we blow the fucker, or blow the bugger up. Hey. My luck, I go down there and beat the hearts inside that place. Oh, it slides. That makes way more sense. Why does this one sink? Hang on. And I can go all the way around the room. That's such bull. The first one sunk immediately, and this one's like, oh, no, no, no. You, you can do what you want with it. Alright. Let's ride on it. It's sturdy. So we're gonna just chill on it for right now and then swap to the bow and arrow. Come on, both if no, there's, no. A, if there's anything, get it. No. Boo. If there's anything, give you what? I was gonna say, if there's anything, give me a. Let's um, call um, bow, arrow thing is not. Oh, 
Okay. Oh, I guess I'm doing a quick run. So all the enemies died, which unlocked that door to this chest. That's good to know. So it's a good thing I shot them all down. Yeah. Yeah, this one's relying heavily on bow and arrows. Frustrating. Three pots here. Looks like more arrows for a handful. Nope. Oh. Another bigger house. Oh, nice. Oh. This is the oh. Yeah, every dig spot I find gives me rupees. Weird. Yeah, every single one of them I, I, I've dug off is giving me rupees so far. I think they're predestined what they actually give. So, like, if one gives a fairy, it will always give a fairy the first time. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. Oh. More rupees. There we go. All right. Ye who seek the entrance to the king's treasure, look for the two statues that face one another. Show your bravery and jump into the mouth of the sleeping statue, and the path opens before you. Remember all that in your gold. Appreciate you. Interesting. Okay, I thought he was going to give me improved gloves. So I could dig into the holes now, but nope, not yet. <laughs> How you doing, Codex? I am in the process of running all the way back, trying to find, hoping that I find something. It's literally like all the way at the base where you first killed like those initial goblins. There is uh, a big spot there. And yeah, it's funny. Like They're times. actually spot uh, respawn back. My goblins down there back. <laughs> Well, so I killed the one on top, and I got arrows, though. So, like, win-win? Yeah. Are you at 20 arrows? No, I'm at 11, but you know what? I worked for me. Okay, so there's a big spot down there that you should check, though, because three out of three times I got arrows out of it. So you need arrows for the quest, so specifically give you arrows at the first big spot. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Have you gotten rid of the little robot guy yet, or no? Yeah. Perfect. I'm well past that. <laughs> Excellent. That's why I was telling you just go grab arrows real quick, bro, because there'd be so much faster just to, like, knock it out. But yeah, man. Um, it's not too far past there. Like, once you pass that bridge, you're inside the volcano area, and then, like, it's really easy from there. Yeah, I think there's a save point, like, right there, too, you said. Yeah. Hey, and I got arrows for killing that guy, so now I'm back up to 20. Inside the volcano. We're getting there. Oh, yeah? You made it in now? Alright, so from there, you gotta basically take aggro from the 10 bats and kill all of them. Then you run up the left side path, and then there's the lizards down there and the two guys who can spit at you. Shoot both the guys who can spit at you. Okay, so I just got rid of the bats. Good news is I'm getting my hearts back up, thankfully. Don't say wait for me. And then once you cross where the lizards are, then uh, you just go on the path on the right and there's no more enemies. Dick. Dead. 
No! Oops, this will be bad. That's gonna hurt. Yeah. I don't think this dungeon's gonna be all oh. that tough. Ran out the wrong huh. way. Oh, you ran out to the waterfall, not the, uh. <laughs> yeah. Thingy. Fires out. Nice. And we'll hit up this save point right here. And okay. there we go. Nice. Well, if you guys enjoyed the episode, be sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see y'all. We'll see y'all in the next one. Have a good night, guys. Oh. Peace.